Well, disappointing and unfortunate. Those are the words the mayor and police chief used after three IMPD officers were arrested within just a few days. Yeah, they spoke with Wish TV's Tim McNicholas about those arrests. He's live at IMPD headquarters now. Tim, what are you learning about these officers? Well, Police Chief Brian Roach says those arrests should not, quote, take away from all the good work they've done and that other officers do every day. At least two of those officers have been honored by IMPD in the past with awards, but now all three are facing criminal investigations and IMPD administrative investigations. Hi, how are you? The mayor and police chief walk through Indy's neighborhoods every month, talking to the locals and trying to build trust. It should give uh, the community and, and the public uh, a, a little bit of relief to know that uh, those were our peers and, and they were arrested by their peers. Those peers are Timothy Elliott, Dustin Keaty, and Troy Fitz. Fitz is a 28-year IMPD veteran arrested last night on a preliminary charge of domestic battery. Police say they arrested Keaty and Elliott Monday night for driving drunk in Fountain Square. It's unfortunate when those uh, circumstances occur, and we try to minimize them whenever we can. IMPD says their victim's assistance team is reaching out to the victim of domestic battery. The officers involved in both incidents will be referred to IMPD's Office of Health and Wellness. Uh, that's kind of a case management. It helps officers uh, through whether it's substance abuse, whether it's financial, whether it's uh, 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 domestic issues. Personnel files show the two officers arrested for drunk driving have both been honored more than once through IMPD's Honor Award Program. IMPD named Elliott Officer of the Month back in 2016. So you look at it both the choices that they made, but also as an organization, I think you have to look within yourself. Is there anything about our profession that may have led to that? All three of those officers are now on administrative leave. The prosecutor has not yet filed formal charges. Prosecutor Terry Curry says he has prosecuted 70 police officers since 2011. Live at IMPD headquarters, I'm Tim McNicholas, Wish TV, News 8.